and the official word from the National Weather Service is Honolulu has been setting and tying records. But the question now is, will those records remain valid? The high in Honolulu today was 92 degrees. It was the hottest June 15th since the Weather Service started keeping track, and it was the eighth straight day we've broken or tied a record. There was a lot of wind, but you can feel the heat a lot. But was it really that hot? That's what the experts at the National Weather Service have been wondering. They settled their suspicions with a trip to the airport to check Honolulu's official temperature sensor. We've had uh, one of our uh, technicians visit the site and they did a side-by-side -side calibration and found that the uh, thermometer at the Honolulu airport was reading a little bit warmer than what his calibration thermometer was reading. Two degrees warmer. There's some wiggle room with the accuracy of the temperature sensor, which means... If it's reading 90, the, accurate, the thermometer is only accurate to read within about 2 degrees, so it could be anywhere between 88 and 92. Which means our records these past 8 days may not be records after all. If it turns out after further investigation of the thermometer and the temperature, or the temperature sensor at the airport that those data were skewed, I think we can work with the Climate Data Center to have the data either asterisked or stricken from the record as being official records. The National Weather Service is going to check those numbers, and if it turns out that the numbers were skewed, then it may just strike those from the record.